Hi, this is Pam, and I have a special unboxing. It's from TK Crystal Wholesale on TikTok. They've changed their name. I will tag that in my video. I can't remember what it is. Crystal something, Crystal Lith something. They got um, banned from TikTok because they were showing too many female body parts. Anyway, I have a lot of big items here. So um, I've got stands. They do make stands for some of your items, but though you do have to pay separate for them, I believe they're like $5 each. So they made stands for two of my items because I paid for them. And I just don't know if I'm going to have enough room here. <laughs> and I got that humongous tower in. So that was two packages right there. The tower and what I had bought that day came as two separate packages because the tower had to come separate. And then I had another box that was really heavy, big, and I haven't looked at the invoice because I want to surprise myself, but I think I know what's in it. And that was from unpaid baskets. They get a lot of unpaid baskets. People don't realize how much the shipping is. So let us get into our first item here. Let's go with the small one. I've got them stacked, these packages stacked up all over. <laughs> all right. I've been excited to get these. You don't get free items with them either. So like... With their people who do um, sh shop with them a lot, which I'm hopefully I'm getting to that point with them, they will sometimes give you, if, if you're looking at something that's only 2 or $3, let's say it's yours for free from on us. So I haven't run it, but I don't normally buy those 2 or $3 items. All right, let yeah. me see what this is. Okay, that's what I thought. This is a yellow tourmaline. Isn't that cool? This was unpaid basket, I believe. Or was it a new arrival? I don't remember. Isn't that pretty? I have pink tourmaline. I have black tourmaline, not in the specimen, but in some of my other uh, crystals. But I didn't have a yellow tourmaline, so I had to get it. Isn't that nice? Pretty. Oh, and I forgot my light. That'll really make this pop. Okay, so that new ring light that I bought... <laughs> The other day, it ended up breaking yesterday. It just, it's very unstable, the tripod is. And it gets a little top heavy when you have the ring light on, up, working. And it tipped over and it broke right off. Just cheap plastic crap. Anyway, so I got it um, duct taped. Duct tape is your friend. <laughs> anyway, so this is the yellow tourmaline. Isn't that pretty nice and shiny? Yes. I love my raw specimens. You cannot, you can get a lot of fake crystals out there, but when it comes to the raw specimens, they are not fake. But there are still low and high quality specimens. I don't know enough about yellow tourmaline or specimens to know if this is a high quality one or not. I would imagine the one that shows more tourmaline in it, the yellow part of it, is probably a higher quality, to be quite honest. Which is what I look for when I buy specimens, if it has, you know, the coloring of it. Let's get on to the next one. Ooh, I'd forgotten I bought this owl. Isn't that gorgeous? And I know I did because I love owls. Uh, let me see what this is. I think it's a uh, sphere light with aura on it. It just says owl. It doesn't tell you the material, <laughs> but it looks like sphere light to me. Sphere light, and it definitely has aura on it. Isn't that pretty? Oh yeah, look at the druzy. Yes. Oh yeah, nice pretty. Hi Sam. Sam's in here pestering me. He says, you're always in the office. Oh yeah, here we go. That That's better. Nice carving. They have some different items, that's for sure. That's why I like buying from them. It gets a little expensive with their, oh, the big juicy on the bottom. It's a little expensive with their shipping, that's for sure. That is cool. It's like this tablecloth that I have now is one of the tapestries that I bought from them for $3. I bought it intentionally to use it for uh, my videos and stuff like that. And when I take pictures from my shop, which is PJ's Crystal Bliss on Esty. 
And I figured to get people to buy, I've had a few visitors, but I haven't had anyone buy anything yet. They need to be unusual items. Of course, I don't have a reputation on SD yet. I haven't had any sales or reviews. So people are a little leery of that, which I don't blame them. Isn't that pretty, that gold? Ooh. Yeah, so I don't blame them for that. I would be leery, leery too. Nice. Those eyes look almost like Marvel in there. Anyway, that's cute. So I got my pink, uh, my tourmaline and my owl. This was unpaid basket. I was looking on my invoice. Yeah, so somebody had paid for this originally, and then they decided they didn't want it, probably because of the shipping or whatever. You can't pay them direct. You have to, they have to invoice you, and I think that's their biggest problem. When they invoice people, they just don't respond back. So they have a lot of unpaid baskets, which is nasty, really. Yeah, I knew I paid for two. I bought two yellow tourmaline. Wow, that's nice. So this was my small one. I don't know why I bought this small one when I got this bigger one. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows what I was thinking at the time? Maybe I bought it to give to my brother-in-law. I bought him the pink one before. Yeah, come to think of it, I don't have a pink tourmaline specimen. I've got pink tourmaline spears, but not specimens. Because I gave him the one I bought. Oh, and here's the bottom of it. Nice. Wow. Just amazes me. Someone um, made a comment on my newsletter that I sent out from my author name. Um, and I was talking about my crystals, and he, he, or, I, he or she, I'm not sure. I, I assume by the tone of the email, it was a male, said that they had to quit following because I've been getting stranger and stranger, and that crystals are new age crap. And it's like, new age? They've been using crystals in the shamans and Native Americans in the Egyptian time. It's not new age. <laughs> oh, what an idiot. But anyway, isn't that nice? Ooh, ooh, so I got two of them, a small one and a bigger one. And they weren't expensive. That's the whole thing. They're, they're not expensive, but like I said, then you have to think about the shipping. So whatever you buy, you're just going to divide up your shipping between all your items. I like the bottom of that. All right. Let's get on to... I'm going to need my bigger ones for last. Of course, I always do. And I know what's in this really, really big one over here. Heavy one. That, that came from an unpaid basket also. Oh. Yes, selenite. I believe this was... Um, yeah, this was from unpaid basket. Somebody had bought it. Then they didn't pay for it. Or they claimed it. Let's put it that way. They claimed it. And then they decided they didn't want it. Oh, isn't that pretty? I don't have a big piece of selenite like this. Selenite is used for getting negativity off of your crystals in your environment, but it's very fragile. You can scratch it with your fingernail, so you have to be careful of it. Wow, isn't that pretty? So somebody had claimed it, and then when it came time to pay for it, they just ignored it or said, no, send it back. So when the, usually on the unpaid baskets, they'll give you a little bit off of them. You know, like if it's $15, they may give it to you for 12 or something like that. I mean, it's not much, but that's pretty carving. Yes, my selenite. Okay. I had forgotten actually that I had ordered this because it was, I knew what else I had ordered with this, like the owl. I forgot about the owl too. It was another item that I bought that day from the unpaid baskets that really got my attention and that's what I've been waiting for. <laughs> Not these little items, sorry guys. Ooh. This is what I've been waiting for too. They call it fish eye, but it's actually a popolite, something like that. It has some really amazing properties on it too. Anna had a humongous fish eye um specimen on her channel it was going for like 1200 or something like that but it was huge and i was so tempted for it and it did look like it had little fish eyes all over it but i didn't get it and so then when i hopped over to um later on that that day or the next day or whatever within a week's time i hopped over to uh, tk crystals and they were also selling them not those big pieces but something like this and a hell of a lot cheaper isn't that pretty but they're very sought after because of, it looks like 
black tourmaline maybe in there. There's some kind of inclusions in them though. There's the bottom, the matrix that it came from. A few crystals, a few of them popped off when um, I opened the thing. They had broken off during transport, the teeth. But so many of them look like amicet with the teeth and stuff, but they're still a different formation. And that's going to go on my specimen shelf for sure. I don't think I'm going to sell this one. I look at stuff now that I might want to resell. Yeah. But then once I get it in hand, who knows, I may keep it. <laughs> like this owl. I like owls, so i probably keep this. Mm-hmm. I'll have to think about it. Okay, so let's go on to one of the bigger, another bigger item. Ooh, this is a purple spellerite tower. Look at that. This thing is huge. It goes all the way up to my elbow. Wow, this is not my big tower either. This is not the one. My big ass tower is three feet long. Wow, purple spellerite. It doesn't have the druziness of in it like um it has a little bit of druzy. I see it here. But I think it's fluoride in there. I think that's why it's called purple. Uh, isn't that gorgeous? And that's what one of the stands that I paid for was for this. Nice. Yeah, it doesn't have the druzy druzy in it, like you see with a lot of spellerite. But it's nice to see it without aura. You get so much spellerite with aura on it, which is pretty. Very, very pretty. Very long. <laughs> long and thin. Yeah, they have a lot of amazing towers. If you like towers, they have some, they have humongous towers. I do recommend them, especially when Sarah's on. Sarah is probably, I, she's the host that I've always been on when I'm on there. And they're getting a bit, few more followers, so I think people are starting to discover them. But still, I think a lot of people don't understand when they buy that they're going to have to pay for the shipping. And depending on where you're from, too. Very pretty. Okay, so let's get into, I'm going to leave the big tower for last, because I don't know where the hell I'm going to put it. <laughs> it's so big. Oh my goodness. So let's get to my other item that I've been looking forward to. Yeah, so this is what I've been waiting for too. This is a bear. This was in the unpaid basket. So I got a little bit cheaper. I got $10 off of it, to be quite honest. Isn't that cool? And it's heavy. It's over 16 pounds. It's jade opalite. Opalit, something like that. I tried to do an app check on it, and it came up, comes up with a whole bunch of other crap like serpentine and green jasper, and it's like, no, that's not what it is. But the carving on this is amazing. Oh my god, and it's so damn heavy. But it's very green and shiny, and I just had to have it. You see more of the... It's just not coming in well. Let me turn off my light. It, there's such a, it reflects so much because it's so shiny. It is so shiny. But yeah, this kind of comes in a little bit better without the light on it. it this, this side shows more of the jade color. It's got gold, like gold plating all over it. It's weird. But I saw that and I had to see. Look at how shiny that is. Wow. This thing is just amazing. Oh, I'm so heavy. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't think Sarah even picked it up. I think she just moved it around on the table. <laughs> oh, but this is why my box was so heavy when I got it. That's a problem. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's a nice picture of his face. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Very good carvings. I mean, it's just full of... You can see all the fur on him. I always refer to him as him, don't I? This is gorgeous, though. Beautiful. And you can tell this is a lighter green on this side than it is on the other. Like veins of green. And then underneath the him, yeah, he doesn't, he's not as green, light green on this side, he's darker which is where it's reflecting the most. 
Wow, he is a beauty. Oh, if you know exactly what this is called, I would like to know, just even in my comments. But I'm going to try to do some more research on it too. But she said it was Jade Opalit, something like that. And I know there is a man-made Jade. And I'm, I'm thinking this might be man-made Jade because of the price for something this big and this heavy. Very nice indeed. So let me get to that last big one. The last big tower. This tower is three feet long. At least the, the packaging was, and this kind of more or less fit the packaging, so it might be a little under three feet. But oh, it's gorgeous, and it's got gold flakes in it. Wow. I don't know if you can see it reflecting or not. Yeah, right there, there's some of it reflecting. It just reflects the light, though. You don't see it as gold. Lapkite. Lapkite? I saw this and went, oh, I just had to have it in for the price. It is... Oh, I just had a nice flash right there. Oh, uh, there they are. They're flashing. You just can't see them as gold. Let me see if it works better. Sometimes the ring light works better. Other times it doesn't because it's too much. Wow, this thing is huge. It's got gold all over it. Gold flashing. Wow, this is huge. So it goes from my fingertips up to the, my armpit, and I'm tall, so I've got long arms. This is going to go on my floor, too. I've kind of picked out another area in my living room to put these on, these bigger items. And now you can really see the gold flashing in there. I ought to be getting muscles handing all these crystals because <laughs> they're getting all these big items. Oh my god. And it did come in a um, PCP piping, which really was a great idea. It protects it. Wow, this is really neat. All right, so that's what I bought. Two, two days. It isn't just one day. This was two orders, two separate orders, two different days. I get my raw fisheye, two um, yellow tourmalines, my spillerite owl with aura on it, my selenite unicorn carving, my purple spillerite spear, um, um, tower, my lab kit tower, humongous tower with the gold flashing on it. Ooh, it's so cool. And then this beautiful opal, not opal, beautiful jade opalite, opalite, something like that, um, bear, which, yeah, this takes up my, my desktop big time. Woohoo! Isn't that cool? So I will tag them in my video, and I'll also put them down there in my description where you can go and buy these amazing items yourself. If you like. I mean, it won't be these amazing items, but they have amazing items all the time. They do. They do. They make a lot of their own um, crystals there because they're a factory. So they bring in the, the chunks of rock and then they, they form a lot of their own uh, towers and spears and stuff. But anyway, let me know what you think in the comments and thank you so much for watching. Pamela out.